Hey guys, Kevin here, and this is Pure Reviews, where I review all kinds of products. So if you are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And if you find this particular video helpful, be sure to hit that like button before you go. Maybe leave a comment. Those really help with the channel a ton, and I greatly appreciate it. So, today's product is available on Amazon, and there is a link in the description that will take you to the product page where you can see the current price point, see if it's on sale, all that lovely information. But what is it? So they are a pair of sports earbuds. Um, this is the box they're gonna come in. The model number is YYK-Q63. Uh, once you open them up, you are of course going to get a little user manual that tells you how to operate them, uh, frequently asked questions, all that fun stuff. We're gonna cover a lot of those details right now. You are gonna get a USB to USB type C charging cable. This is how you're gonna power them up. Then you are going to get, um, mine came with a little cleansing cloth to keep them clean. And then you're going to get the earbuds themselves. So as you can see, here is the case. Uh, it is nice and compact, which means you can throw it in your bag, throw it if you're traveling in an airport or whatnot, um, going to the gym, easily to throw in your purse. Uh, yeah, so very easy to uh, travel in lightweight. On the back side there, that is where you're going to plug it in to charge it. So let's talk about battery life. So it has a 950 mAh battery. Um, and what does that mean? That means you're gonna get a pretty good battery life out of these. So the case itself will hold um, about 100 hours and the earbuds themselves are about 18 hours. Uh, and then you just pop them back in the case and they will charge up pretty quickly. Uh, with battery life, and this is applies really with any type of earbuds out there, Depending on your volume settings, depending on if you're utilizing it to take phone calls or talk via the digital assistance, that's all going to affect on how quickly the battery life goes down versus if you're just purely listening to music. So just keep that in mind. Um, the hours are very approximate, but you're going to get pretty close to that range, um, which is important when you're kind of looking at these things. So. Um, it does have the latest Bluetooth technology, so it's got the nice long, the Bluetooth 5 point, uh, I think it's 5.3 or something like that. Um, so you get a long range, anything over Bluetooth 5 is got a nice distance to whatever it's paired with. Um, so whether it's your phone or your computer, uh, just keep in mind with anything Bluetooth, the more walls that you throw up between you and your device, the more it's going to impact that signal. If you look up, like, what's the distance, and you see, like, ah, oh, it's, like, 33 feet. Well, that's in a field. It's, you know, once you start throwing up obstructions and other electronics, that does impact um, the distance, but they do have a long distance to them, so you can run to the bathroom, all that kind of stuff, without losing that signal. Um, so, when you open up the case, well, you're going to see the earbuds themselves. So here they are. Now, in the case itself... You are going to see over here a screen. Uh, it's going to give you a number one through a hundred. That's basically telling you kind of where this is in charge time. Like the higher, if it's at a hundred, it's the case is fully charged. Um, if not, then um, you may need to charge it up. Then on this screen, you're going to see some bars going up. Um, that means the earbuds are themselves are charging. If it's solid, then they're fully charged. Um, but yeah, so that means they are charging up, which gives you a quick snapshot of where you are on your battery life. They do have an R and an L, so that way you know which ear to put them in. Um, and so, yeah, let's go ahead and pop one of these out. First thing right off the bat I want to talk about is you'll see those two little copper spots. That is the contact for charging. When you get these things, they're gonna have a little blue piece of tape over that. Be sure to remove that. Otherwise you're uh, gonna be frustrated because your earbuds aren't going to be charging. You're gonna be wondering why. Um, right there, you're gonna have the power button. As you can see, it's lit up. When it is in pairing mode, you're gonna have a blue and red light flashing. Um, and uh, yeah, they pair really easy. They'll automatically pop up. You just need to select them. They're gonna be, uh, the model number is what's just gonna pop up. Now, what's cool about these is you can have them in monotone or in stereo. So if you just want one in and listen to your ambience around you, you can do that. Um, or if you want both, you can put them both on and have stereo. Now, I will say if for whatever reason they don't connect in stereo, you have, you know, they just, just didn't connect. It should do it automatically. Just put them back in the case, close the case, 
wait a couple seconds and redo it. That seems to reset them. Um, I've only had that happen once, but uh, it just put them in the case, reset it, and that worked like a charm and getting them back to where they would sink into each other. Now on the top here is the plus and minus button. Uh, that is going to allow you to adjust the volume of these things, or if you're wanting to change to the next song or go back to the same song, you'll use that button right there. Now, how you are going to turn these on is you're simply just gonna hold down the power button um, and it'll turn on the headphones. Now, if you wanna activate the voice assistant, you're gonna hold down for two seconds and it'll be able to activate that if it's paired to your phone. Uh, it uses all the major brands voice assistants um, if that is important to you. I don't really use these for phone calls, um, so I don't really use them also for like the assistants. It's a feature you have. Same thing with the phone calls. You can answer through this. Um, I haven't really tested like how's the sound quality to other people. It does have a mic. Um, so if that's an important feature for you, these do these can do that um, if you want. Now, as far as sound quality, um, they have a 10 millimeter speaker in each one. And I would say they are an affordable budget headset. Um, so the sound quality kind of matches that. They sound pretty good for the price point, in my opinion. Um, but don't be expect to be like blown away with this incredible sound like you would expect for ridiculously expensive headphones. So um, they are great value for the money, in my opinion. Um, uh, they are a little heavier on the bass and the overall sound isn't as crisp because of that, I feel. Uh, just kind of when I listen to it, that's, that's kind of where I feel, but they're great for working out. Um, if you're riding the bus or the train or something like that, they're great transportation headphones. Um, I like them for those aspects. Um, as far as you can see now, because they are over the ear, uh, that's a feature that I really like about them because they stay on. Uh, my ears are kind of shallow, so sometimes the little ones that you stick in your ears, they'll pop out if I'm running or something like that. And so uh, these are a little bit more comfortable because they are over the ear. They are super lightweight. Uh, by being lightweight, uh, you're not getting that ear fatigue, which is really nice if you're going to wear them for a longer period of time. Uh, you kind of almost like don't even realize they're there. That's how lightweight they are, which is pretty impressive. Um, and uh, yeah, it's got the nice little red look to it, uh, which is kind of, kind of pop of color, if you will. Uh, and yeah, and that's basically the ins and outs of these little guys. If there is something that I didn't cover that you're curious about, feel free to hit me up in the comment section. I do typically respond to those. And uh, until the next video, you guys take it easy. Later. Congrats, you made it to the end of the video. Thank you very much. Um, greatly appreciated for the support. Be sure to uh, hit that like button on the video. It really, really does help out. And if you have not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell if you want to uh, get notified when new videos come out on this channel.